why all of the Conservatives walked out at one point? Yeah, so uh, after nine years of Justin Trudeau and his NDP Liberal government, we're in a situation where even the NDP government in British Columbia has called for the Liberals to end the wacko decriminalization policy that they've implemented there that sees drugs like uh, heroin, crack, uh, cocaine, um, and all orders of illegal substances um, now being used on playgrounds, transit, coffee shop, patios, and in hospitals. It's a situation where it's um, so wacko that nurses who work in hospitals are afraid of breastfeeding their babies when they go home because they're concerned about the crack smoke that they're being exposed to in British Columbia hospitals. So the leader of the official opposition raised the, uh, the issue of this wacko policy and was, uh, and was um, ejected by the Liberal Speaker um, for calling it exactly what it is. And so uh, so we're not going to stay uh, in proceedings when there's two sets of rules. One set of rules for a prime minister who isn't asked to follow the same rules that the official opposition is. Our job is to ask questions and to hold the government accountable. It's not the job, of course, of, of the speaker because he's a liberal to protect a prime minister whose wacko policies are putting people's lives in danger. And now we know that the liberals are considering the same policy. It's a wacko policy, but for uh, for the city of Toronto here in Ontario. But Mr. Polyev was asked to withdraw the comment and he did not twice. Yeah, Why not? Why not? Instead of having this situation where he was removed from the house why not withdraw that comment yeah quite simply mr polyev uh, did withdraw the did withdraw the comment he replaced uh, it he did not withdraw it well, he said he replaced well, it and the, the, and, the, the, and, and of course and, of course the problem mike is that uh, the the problem is that um, the, there's two sets of rules there was a set of rules that was being applied to the leader of the official opposition and there was a set of different set of rules being applied to the prime minister and so uh, mr polyev laid out very clearly that it's a wacko policy and and uh, and so um, it's for the prime minister to explain why he's letting that stay so what, what happens to the House of Commons? What happens to...